Berger Chevrolet has been serving West Michigan's automotive needs since 1925. For nearly 100 years, the Berger family and employees have been dedicated to supporting small businesses, nonprofits, and charities in our community. Through their Berger Gives Back campaign, employees have volunteered, raised awareness, provided funds, and supported locally owned businesses right here in West Michigan. Berger Chevrolet is proud to partner with Fox 17 to sponsor We're Open West Michigan. Learn more at BergerChevy.com. All right, and today's Taste of the Town sponsored by Berger Chevrolet. If you're wanting the taste of Italy, you are in luck. There's a restaurant in Ada that's sure to please. Nonas, the Trattoria, or is it Trattoria? Well, you know, it serves up some of the tastiest Italian dishes in West Michigan. I know that. I got a chance to sit down with the owner, Ron Cook, to learn more. Well, if you're in the 80 area and you're looking for a true taste of Italy, Nona's Trattoria is the place everyone's talking about. Ron Cook, the owner of Nona's, thanks for uh, having us out today. Thank you for coming. So tell us the history. I, I understand you have a bit of time spent in Italy, so this food is authentic. As, as authentic as we can get it in the States, let's put it that way, yeah. Tell us your history. How did it all start? I was the president of La Marzocco Espresso Machines in Florence for 15 years. And when the recession hit, the bottom dropped out of our business and uh, we had to return to the, Uni the United States. I was in my early 60s at the time. My wife and I decided we would just plant ourselves here. After about a year or so, we found a location across the street to open the first, the known as Cafe, which was uh, how we started with a coffee machine, of course. It makes sense that you right. would your origin really starts with coffee, but I'm sure your love of Italian food carried over. The European food in general carried over, yeah. Um, I told my wife that um, uh, we ought to do some pastries in the afternoon that we could bake off in the morning. We'll just, you know, close at two o'clock. She said, no, you have to do your omelets. And I said, no, I'm not going to do my omelets. And and she said, you have to do your omelets. And I said, I'm not going to go from president of a company to short order cook. And I did. And then this building came available three years later. And uh, there were a number of people from the community who just wanted to see a restaurant here. So I mean, basically what you've got here is you've got an American who lived in Italy translating Italian and French recipes to a Mexican chef in Ada, Michigan with American ingredients to a largely Dutch audience. So it's a what melting could go, pot. What could go wrong? You know? <laughs> it's a true melting pot true of melting flavors pot. and of people. Yeah. Eight years ago, you started with the cafe. Right. A few years later, you opened this trattoria. Correct. Okay. Correct. And how did that first year go? Um, it was chaos on steroids. Uh, um, we went through three chefs. Um, and uh, I, you know, I, it was my first restaurant, which I opened at age 69. And uh, uh, we, it took a while to settle in. But um, we did settle in pretty quickly, and we've been very successful ever since. And, and I, you know, it's very rewarding uh, that we uh, are uh, as accepted as we are by the community. Obviously, you've eaten a lot of Italian food. What would be the closest thing on your menu that brings those memories of Italy back? Um, the veal saltimbocca, veal uh, pounded thin with a slice of prosciutto and a, uh, sage leaf, and it's it's uh, just pan fried in a little uh, white wine sauce. Obviously, you made it through that first year. You've got a great returning business. This place is buzzing right now. We had such loyal customers that in 28 degree weather on a Saturday night, we had. Two Two turns on every table out here in the middle of winter. That's Go amazing. figure. We are a very loyal clientele, uh, and we we are very long on customer service to take care of them. Well, from president of a company to short order cook to now one of the most beloved bands in Ada because he's bringing the true taste of Italy right here at Nona's Trattoria. Come have some great food. It's our taste of the town. I know it sounds cliche, mm. but try the veal. <laughs> it, it really was that good. It was delicious. Known as is located at 5848 Ada Drive Southeast in Ada. You can check their full menu out at nona.com. We'll be right back.